There are some universal tools which allow you to determine price and time. Hi, this is Mario from Forex Other Way. Today I will show you how you can build up such a tool yourself. So let's start the rock and roll. In my previous video when I, when I was talking to you about diamonds, I just didn't mention one single thing. I just want to show you today how it works. So let me start from here. We are on USD Japanese daily chart. So let's build up a diamond over here, a quick one. So that's the one from bottom to top. And the other one, we drag the line. Where is this line? It's over here. We drag it in from, it's, oh, come on, babe. It's not this one. All right, we're dragging another line from the bottom to the bottom. So we got the very beginning of our cycle. Let's do it. Let's double it up. And let's double the other one again. Here we go. Done. Where are we? Let me show you something. All right. So we got the time which we forecast. It is over here. So we got a cycle, that length of the cycle. Okay, let's drag another one here. So between those two vertical lines, we got the length of the cycle. We might try to work it out, but doesn't matter. But the most important thing is that here we got the term in the time. As you might see, I'll zoom in a little bit. As you might see, it hit exactly the top. Well, it happens. It happens, trust me. But the price and time did not square, as it should do, because we got the time factor here. You might realize that when WD Gunn was talking about time and price squaring, he meant that on horizontal line there was a time on vertical line there was a price and squaring meant in my opinion was meeting each other at a certain point so if time squares if price squares time it usually it occurs turning on the market this turn wasn't big because you see the price was supposed to be here and the time, the time was right, but the price wasn't. Let's have a butcher's further down what's happening here. As you realize, this price was hit already over here. We might try, we might try to see whether it worked with this cycle. The cycle started from here. That was the length of the cycle. Let's see whether it hit or not. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. It came here. And if we measure the next one, this length, it works. Trust me, these cycles, they do work. You might see somewhere we are in the bottom here. And so on. If we measure it further down, probably we'll get somewhere here. Let's uh, have a butcher's here. Here we go. We got another bottom here. Whoa, is it working? It is somehow. We are again in this bottom. It's not that small, trust me. It's a quite a good couple of pips here from this bottom to the top. So anyway, but as you see, the price is ranging. So it's nothing. It's not trendy over here. Let's, uh, let's try it once again. I'll show you another one. Because if we are here, you say it's just one example okay let's try another one let's delete all the stuff here and let's go further so let's say this one we measured how did we do this was this this one boom 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 okay but we can also try another one let's try the next one the next one from the top from the top come on from the top we drag it to the top. We got one line. And another one. Okay, let's, let's make it 
just to copy it easier and another one again we drag from the top to the bottom the trend line let's see let's see what's happening now all right so we copy this one and make a diamond here it seems slightly like godly patterns and let's have a butchers we got the corner here we got the local bottom somewhere we might presume that from here to here it is a cycle which which uh, confluences price and time that's the reason why it's made like a diamond all right so let's have a butchers now on this cycle we got the cycle over here presumably we got the cycle over here why it doesn't work geez oh come on come on come on not this one okay let's delete it we do it this way and we make this line again here that's the line we are here okay so we presume that this cycle would show us something let's have a butchers that's the one where are we let's drag the line that's the line boom we hit okay it's working it's working so let's uh, just to make it simple let's drag another line it's not working it's local top but it's not that much let's have a butchers further what's going on is the same length of the cycle and over here we got a local top here but it's nothing special but trust me when you realize when you look this way and you zoom in you might see that from here to here the cycle is 100 pips so it's a small one let's try another one again we are on the top let's try another one trust me these cycles they do work we are at the very bottom of this ranging market and then the market started to rise let's have a butchers again what's happening here that's the one and let's have a butchers further down what's happening here and then the market get into the new cycle but i assure you if you again copy it further you will see that somewhere bottoms and tops will appear here here we go here we got a local top somewhere there was a correction that's the reason the market tried to get down so in this way as i've shown you is a small it's a small figure it's a short part of the trend but if you get it longer you will get really really good results so let's get those trend lines one two three four three we got two of them only all right let's get rid of all of them of those trend lines and we can try another one if you if you don't mind we can try any one you want for example like this one we can do it also in this way from here what is that what did i do no it's not that it's from, is it this one no all right so we drag it once again from here to here bottom to bottom and let's drag it this way from the bottom to the latest top and do you mind if i try to get it this way do you mind and let me do this way okay so now let's make it clear based on what we have known we had bottom bottom and top and we didn't know what was this part about we didn't know this one we just had only bottom 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 and top we drag this line and it has shown us not only time it is the time from here to here is the length of the cycle so this cycle was given to us this cycle we we might have tried to do it from from this way from this way from this way 
we had a cycle already determined which was from here to here and based on the cycle known we could have predicted pot where the potential turning point is as a matter of time in the length but also as a matter of price look here we got this price here obviously the price was overshot doesn't matter i'm not saying it's exact as it should be but have a butcher what's happening later on this level was respected here was respected here again here was broken the price came back to this level it was respected further down so then around this level market was ranging a year later or whatever we got d d1 so this level it will be respected over and over so anyway what i wanted to show you in this video i did i hope watch watch my other videos use the diamonds for your own benefit it really works trust me in this way you can determine not price only but time as well have a good one i see you next time bye bye